This is In the Dugout with George Evans. Um, the proudest moment of my career has to be making my debut for Manchester City. It was um, an achievement that I came up through every age group and to the first team. And uh, being a City fan as well, that was um, something I'm very proud of. Uh, David Silva, I think his best player I've played with. Just in training, learning from him. There's some fantastic players at City, obviously. Yeah, yeah, definitely up there as well. But for me, I just think uh, David Silva is the best that I've played with. Uh, the best player that I've ever played against was uh, we trained against Argentina when they came over to England. I think they had a game against Portugal and uh, Messi was training and obviously uh, we did a bit of um, possession and a bit of 11 v 11 and he was by far the best player I've ever come up against. But it's just the way he does things where he gets out of situations where you try and get near him but you, you can't and it's, um, that was a great experience for me and he's definitely up there and definitely is the best player I think in the world. <laughs> no, I, I loved school, it was decent, it was a good set of, good set of lads at the time and um, I really enjoyed it. But I'd have to say, going in PE and playing footy with your mates and stuff was probably the best subject we could be in, yeah. Science, I'm never good at science. I'm not any a big fan. Any particular science? All of it all together. Just one in it, out of the other, I just didn't get any of it. No, I've always been uh, a midfielder. I played uh, centre back a few times, and then obviously when you're younger, I played a bit further forward. But it's uh, I've generally always been a midfielder. I would like to, to score goals and uh, stop goals as well. <sighs> a bit of a mismatch, really. Before games, I like to listen to a bit of R&B, and then sometimes in the morning, driving to train and stuff, I like it to be a bit slower and a bit bit more relaxed. But uh, generally, just R&B music. I've only been here a short time, so there's only a few of the boys that put the iPods in the dressing room and generally it's pretty good, so I've not really heard nothing too bad yet, but I'm sure I'll find out some, uh, some bad music soon. Uh, I used to play a lot of cricket before obviously football took over and that was something that I really enjoyed, but uh, other than that, just nothing, nothing really that I get up to other than just watching, watching more football and uh, taking the dog out for a walk, things like that. I enjoy my cricket, obviously the 2020s and stuff in the summer is really good. The test match gets a bit too long, a bit boring, but the, like, watching my friends play 2020 and it's something that I enjoy. Yeah, obviously being being close to it and the team that I've always gone to watch with mates and stuff, so I'd support Lancashire, yeah. No, I've still not done mine yet, so you have to wait and see for that. But we've got, we've got a away trip coming up soon, so uh, that'll be your first time because I missed out on the trip to Ipswich, so. I'll be uh, I'm sure I'll be doing it soon. Uh, do you have a song in mind for it? I do, but you'll have to find out for that. <laughs> <laughs>